Hi class, now that we've read the book Chrysanthemum, I want you to get your reader's notebook and I want you to sit down by a family member and I want you to ask them why you were named your name. So some of you might have a special reason for you being named your name. Maybe you are named after a grandparent or a special person in your life. Maybe your parents just really liked that name. I know that for me, I was named after a character in a book. When I was in my mama's belly, she was reading the book Heidi, and it's about a little Swiss or a little Swiss girl who has blonde hair and blue eyes and that lives with her grandfather. And my mom loved that book. And so she read that book with all of us when we were little. And so she really liked that story. And so she named me Heidi. And it ended up that I ended up having blonde hair and blue eyes, just like that character. And so the name really fit. So in my writer's notebook, I might draw a picture. I'm gonna open it up to the to the my next page. And I'm gonna write, I'm gonna have I'm gonna write or I'm gonna have my, my parent write. My name is Heidi because I was named after a character in a book. And then I might draw a picture of that book or I might draw a picture of my mom reading to me. If I was named after my grandparent, I might draw a picture of my grandma. But really important thing there is that you have that sentence that tells me why you're named who you are. So that's how you're gonna to respond to our book, Chrysanthemum, about the character who was named after a flower. I'm excited to find out why you were named the way you are.